Welcome to the Glammy Plan Out. We're going to plan today in my classic size dashboard for the week of December 7 through 13. If you like the video, please subscribe. If you don't like the video, tell your enemies and have them subscribe. All right, first, before we get into this, I want to talk about something I discovered and kind of created myself. Not sure exactly where I got the idea, but I haven't seen it done before. I bought a coil, not a coil bounder. Oh, I forgot what kind of th these binders are called. Uh, it's not coil, it's something else. But what I did was I used cardstock. And I cut the cardstock, thought maybe I'd be able to show you. I, I cut the cardstock about two inches. And then I tape runnered the sticker pages onto that cardstock. One piece of cardstock, two pages. Um, I found that using the runner, I used one and a half of these, so I switched over to double-sided tape. And once you get done uh, taping your sticker pages on, they will gap a little bit. So I just take a little bit of piece of tape and cover that at the corners where I want the gap. Now once you do this, if you do not have the binding machine, I got mine on Amazon, you can also take your sticker book to a local Staples office supply store and they can coil bind this for you. And I've had coil bound stuff done for me before and it's usually two to three dollars at most. They can punch it and bind it and it doesn't matter the size. I find for me, I gotta do that one. I find for me my brain just kind of works with it better open like this than flipping up. I'm not gonna lie, it was a little time consuming, but I think it's worth it because I'll go through and fix these. Because I can also, when I take apart the sticker book, I wanna keep it under its sticker book itself, but on the inside of it, I can change the way that it is organized. I find that sometimes there'll be quotes throughout or the little to-dos throughout or the numbers throughout, and I could put all those together and organize it the way I want. If you actually want a full tutorial of this, please let me know, but I'm finding this time saver. I'm loving it. I just used one of my older sticker books. That's why some of them actually don't have many pages at all. Just wanted to see how it would come out. Um, again, just an idea to help you with organizing. Now, it doesn't, whenever you pile them up, if you do them, Pile them, you'll actually have to flip flop them, I think. I don't know, it just kind of depends. Haven't discovered how exactly to store this on the shelf yet, but I'm loving this so far. All right, now to the actual planning part. I'm using Very Plaid Christmas by Victoria Thatcher. It is a free printable. I have not been compensated for this in any way. I just go on her site, which I'll link below, and print and cut. Um, see, I use a silhouette, but I believe she also has them for the pre-cut, if I'm saying that correctly, as well. All right, so I've done a little pre-planning getting together. All right, I don't want this today. So I actually have cut a little bit of extra sticker paper I had. Let's see, and it's definitely too long here. So let's cut a bit more of this off. Let's, see, let's hope I don't go too... Yep, I still went to... See, let me get it would help if I actually put everything out, huh? All right, so let's put this here. I'm gonna go ahead and just cut that to fit the way that I want it just to cover these up. I'm going to go ahead, I hope I have enough there to cover up that two by because this is not going to be a two by zone. Uh, I'll have to put a little, another little sticker there, but I think we've got plenty of that right now. Uh, Victoria is just pinning out a whole lot of Christmas things. I teased her this week and told her that I'm just going to have to make all of 2021 Christmas themed at this point. Well, I went too hard on that. Alright, so I'm going to cover these up. What got on there? And you might be able to still see through them a little bit, but if I put anything else on top, it won't be an issue. And I'll definitely have to put a sticker there. Okay which won't be an issue. And this is a little journaling card. I am not sure exactly where I got it from. I'm shopping my stash right now. If I do know where I got things, I will definitely link it below. Okay, that is definitely going to be too long. So I'm going to flip my page over this way to make it easier for me to cut. Let's see, here we go. 
And what I'm using as my guide is just a little six inch, six inch <laughs> metal ruler that I got from, I think, Michael's. But it's just a craft supply. You can get them anywhere. I've even seen these at the smaller department stores. So let's cut that to fit. And I like the metal better because I am less likely to cut it where when I use the plastic rulers, I will sometimes actually cut part of the ruler. Let's see if that was enough. There we go. Tear up. Is that gonna fit? Perfect. All right, I'll actually use my tape runner for this one. Not the scotch tape. I am going to use this square as usual, but not for my dinner plans. I wish they would just leave that one blank, to be honest. But we'll see, I even, I, I'm moving over to the big dashboard for January. I'll just put that aside and use it another side. And so I'm not sure what the sizes are gonna be 100% there. All right, I wanna definitely cover that up. Well, let's go ahead and start with the days of the week, get that done and over with because we know where those go. There's no guessing on that. It looks like I cut a little bit off on that one. I had time to recalibrate my machine. I do use a silhouette and if you don't have a machine, you don't have to use a machine with hers. They're usually pretty square so you can go through with a cutter and this is, I'm not even sure how to say that. I say gyro cut but I could be wrong. The cutting part moves and swivels. You hold it like a pencil and I find it really great to freehand cut as necessary or guide cut if I'm using the ruler. I hate that this did not cut properly but I don't think it'll be able to, I know that's perfect, be able to see it too much. Let's see if this week I can actually put them on the right days. Um, if you do have a machine and at times they start not cutting properly, sometimes your mat is not sticky enough. And if that's the case, if you don't have time to actually just wash it off with warm seppy water and let it dry, I find putting washi on the page will help. But when you do that, be careful where your registration marks are and always put them where they're not. it's not going to be reading where your registration marks are. So you can't do four corners because if the corner there, you're going to mess up your registration mark. So I'll often put something here, here, and on this corner, and right here. And if I can, I'll leave this set alone because it reads that and then it's looking for the next dark. So I try not to tape on that side. That's just something that helps. Looks like I'm going to have a visitor. Why was the dog out? Because I let him out. Okay. Apparently the dog was out. <laughs> Did not realize he had been let outside. Such a good pet parent, huh? All right, the days of the week, I know this is, to me, this is the most boring part because you know it's gonna go, you know where they're at, and maybe one day I'll learn how to fast forward through it. All right, that's that side. Okay, that's gonna be covered. I... See what that be able to cover it up not all the way. Let's see. I'm gonna put the what I believe fit there. Wow, it really did cut bad on this one. I did not notice it. Okay, let's cut it here. Okay, that'll cover that, and I'll punch that. So that won't really matter, I don't think, because that's going to be in the binding part of it. Well, not binding part, but where the rings are. <gasps> no. Oh, I just totally ruined the sticker. Christmas, Christmas is coming. All right, I will find something else to put right there on it. Some way, somehow, I will make that work. Let me see if I can undo that. I cannot believe that. Look what I did. How could you? Okay, just uh, like put some tape over it. I can't just put tape over I'm it. Right. I'm sorry, you're hearing my child. <laughs> Hello. Let's see if you watched any of the other videos we've done one together. Let's see, we're supposed to do another one together. We will do more together. I don't know how to fix that. Oh, I'm so disappointed because I really loved that. Christmas is coming. Put some clear tape over it. I don't have any just plain clear tape. What is 
This is double sided. What is wrong with you? Her idea is to put clear tape on there. Now we might be able to find some somewhere, but I definitely don't want to lose that little piece. Ah. Okay. What? It's somewhere around here. Oh, this is perfect because this is actually where I'm going to put my work schedule. Not here this time. So I actually may not use that. So I'm going to put work schedule here this time. I need something to cover up that to buy. Here we go. Yang Believe. Suggestions? Mm. <laughs> not out but, of these. Oh. But I feel like I feel like it's a little bland around Oh, it will. Here. Yeah, it is for now. I've got some more stickers over here for it. Also, like, on these sides. Well, I'm not done. <laughs> okay, I actually have to work there, so got to be careful how much I put there. So I'm not actually going to be doing anything but work, so I guess I can just go ahead and put one there. Uh -huh. All right, lift that up if I can. This time I'm wearing the fake nails, and it's really harder to lift things up. Not going to happen. Oh, well. I'll know that Saturday. And she's laughing at me. See, I am off Monday. So I do have a day off there, but I am going to be a little busy. I got things to do that day. You know what? I think let's do the gray one here. I can do this way. Let's see how far. And it's sometimes I don't even cut. I just use the metal ruler and tear off right there. There we go. That'll give me a good a good list of place to start. Oh, I really don't know what to do there. Let's see. Well, that fit and cover it up because I don't think I can fit it. There we go. Not exactly what I had wanted, but I think it'll it'll work there. Okay, we're definitely not doing a focus today or this week. Let's see. I don't need that one anymore. I am going to see if there's anything I want out of my Happy Planner Happy Year. I think all the Christmas stuff is in the back. Oh, there is some holly. I was looking for holly. I wanted holly in this one. But I don't have any... But there's no big hollies. That's what I don't like. Let's see. I'm trying to find something for that focus. I thought about using this right here, but... What about some poinsettias? I don't have any poinsettias. Let's see. We'll put this here. I'm sure I'll find. Let me move that down just a bit and we'll cover up the focus and that takes care of that. And I am going to start planning out my planners for, that is so crooked and it's down now, my planners for next year. And I will have two planners, if not more. So I'll use that area for that. I want a quote. I want a Christmas quote. Let's see if there's one in here. No, nope, there's not one in there. And if I can't find one, I'll go online and letter one. Let's see. I thought I saw one there that I wanted. Let's see here. Sorry, I am a little or unorganized today. I'm just going through ideas. See, I had something over here I had wanted. It's looking the Marion Bright, but I already got something for that. That cozy up is cute. All right. There are no weekend plans this year. Or no weekends planned this weekend. Okay, that's not going to work there. Let's see, I've got one more. And this is another wrong wrong. I've been getting things on sale. <laughs> Fair, that is the best way to do it. I love the sweater weather still, but I don't think it's going to work here. We'll put this one here. Not, at, not the same green, but it'll still be cute. I think. There we go. Okay, let's put a little more in here. I really don't have that much because these are really big and I'm finding the big ones are not working with this one as well. Let's see. Do I want that one there? No. Let's do here because there's so much going on right now. It's just that time of year. Nope, that's not going to work. So many things I need to make plans. I need to do my... I got my Christmas list done. But now I need to make out the shopping list for baking and stuff. I think Christmas is about done. See, Sunday, I'm definitely going to have things to do because it will be my Saturday, basically. It's probably when I'll have to go shopping and do some baking. All right, short and sweet, I think. Not quite done. I just thought I was. Psych. I just showed my age there, didn't I? 
Okay, I'm gonna cover this up. Hopefully those won't come through too bad. Well, I guess we'll find out. Okay, I'm gonna cut this off as close to as I can. Okay, oh, good sizing. Let's see how bad that's gonna look. Okay, that's it. Oh, I dropped my clip behind my desk. No idea where I got that little clip. Got a little, uh, let's see where I want to, I guess I'm going to have to do Oh, you know what? I am going to let that 2020 just shine through right there. I think that works. Not the way I had planned it to look, but I think that's cute. All right, this is going to be before the pen, and no, I am not done. I just thought I was. Ha ha. Okay, so... See, we've got garbage day. I'm going to put that as my work schedule. Definitely put how many days. Okay, I'm going to make this one my planning design ideas. So do that. And we made it to the playoffs, and our next game is actually going to be on Thursday. Which reminds me, which reminds me, I'm babysitting. Uh, and you just told the whole world so you're babysitting. Cool. Okay, here's my Saturday shift. Like y'all need to know that, but All seventeen. All right, and let's see. We'll make this. This you can't see it, but it does say to do. Yes, yeah, so we'll make that. To, oh, this said shopping, so we'll make this a, a to do because I've got just so much going on right now. Mm -hmm. So this is going to be December 7th through 13th, unedited. So you'll hear me talking with my child about what's going on. I do hope you have a Merry Christmas. Remember, during this stressful time, take time for you. Uh, take a bubble bath, have a cup of coffee, cup of tea, take a walk. Something to help, help you unwind and focus on yourself so that you will be able to better focus on others. Again, if you like the video, thumbs it up. Tell your friends. If you don't like the video, tell your enemies. Either ways, I'll get view and y'all come back. Thank you. Bye-bye.